So uh, tonight, we're going to select two people from our studio audience and give them their very own cable TV show. And how about, how about here? So what's the point of having a rehearsal? Um, you're the folks that we talked to earlier. Do you, do you mind standing up? OK, how do you do? What is your name, sir? Beecham Owen. Beecham Owen. And, wh and where, are you where are you from? Tampa, Florida. And what do you do for a living in Tampa? Uh, I'm a commercial artist. All right, and who is this? My wife. Hi, what is your Birgit name? Herman. Owen, I'm sorry. We just, no. we just got married. <laughs> okay, I'm, now I'm a little confused myself. Your name is Beecham Owen, and your name is Birgit. Owen. Birgit Owen, okay. Um, and and Birgit, how about you? Is there anything that you would like to share with the uh, American public or the New York City audience? Uh, photography. Oh, so you take some pictures as a mm -hmm. hobby? Yes. Uh, do you have any pictures that you might show? No. No. <laughs> but you would, you would be willing to have uh, take audience calls about photography? Yes. Okay, Art, now are you excited about the prospect of coming to New York City and having your own television show? Sure. Yes, we are. Yeah. <laughs> Look, see. You can barely contain yourself. <laughs> okay, is there anything else I should tell these people before we send them off? A few things. First of all, we have some... Uh, on this program, we give out collapsible drinking mugs, and uh, we've changed these to the Beecham and Burgett Show collapsible drinking mugs, so you can, you can uh, entice viewers with those. Also, we have the uh, Beecham and Burgett Show sponges. This would be nice. We give those out on our show. There you are, sir. Very nice. And, uh, yeah, if things get a little dull, we have Sandy Becker calling bingo. <laughs> so you, you can put that on. Now, Sit right here. Okay, there. see this? You just hold this sign up, and that, that'll be your oh, show. See. see, this is perfect. You can, you can ask people to call in and talk to you about things you might want to do. It's a wonderful hour of television. Ask people to call in and give you suggestions about what you might do on your honeymoon here in New York. <laughs> okay? <laughs> You have to go way downtown, and it, Bill will write up the sign for you. Okay, so you can talk about that. You can talk about photography. Now, we'll be able to see you. See that monitor there on the uh, desk? How can you punch up the monitor and, and... All right, that's the facility from which you'll be broadcasting. Nice. And <clears throat> now we also, we also have some guests for you. Okay, our own Larry Bud Melman will be joining you. <laughs> so it, uh, it sounds like a lot of fun, and, and I hope you guys will enjoy it. Are you really, you got to look forward to this. Oh, it's exciting. It's like a chance yeah. of a lifetime, isn't it? Sure, yeah. yeah. It looks yeah. easy. <laughs> yeah, well, I'm sure it'll be easy. And then I'll call you, there you go, the Beecham and Burgett Show. Is that correctly spelled? No, it isn't. No. <laughs> well, fortunately, we have dozens of these cards printed up. A how, yeah. how is it spelled? B-E-A, right. B-E-A. Those are both very <laughs> unusual first names, aren't they? Is that it? That's right. Yes. Okay. <laughs> All right, there you go. Now, we, uh, we have a car waiting for you folks. You're going to go downtown. Anything else I need to tell them before they leave? Uh, uh, Beecham, thank you very much. You. We'll, we'll see you on television. Thank you, sir. Nice okay. meeting you. Birgit, have a nice trip down. We look forward to seeing you. There they go. We'll be right back. Doing a commercial, then we'll check in on the Beecham and the Birgit Owen show down there on the table place. <laughs> Uh, as you can see, our friends from uh, Tampa, uh, Beecham Owen and uh, Birgit Owen, are now on the air. Great time with the Super Bowl there a couple oh, yeah. months ago. Yeah, so <laughs> we've been going to take any Let's listen in, shall we? They're talking about the Super Bowl. The Super Bowl. This looks are like these calls, are they, uh, Can we take these calls? Good heavens, they certainly okay. have picked this up rather uh, easily. Okay, go ahead and take some calls. Are they taking calls? Um, so, so far, since we've been here, what, what do you like the most? Uh, <laughs> to me, and uh, I know you enjoy that, too. Uh, finding little out-of-the-way restaurants, even though we, every restaurant so far has been a you know, disappointment. <laughs> we stopped to get a bowl of soup the other day, and we were told it was a $5 minimum. Whoa. And, uh, and the, the strange thing is, though, you know, they had the $5 minimum per person. Now, supposing one person came in and sat at a table for two, yeah. and they were by themselves, would they charge them for the empty seat? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Um, <laughs> okay. Are Very they getting any phone uh, calls at all? Subject matter, isn't it? Well, it's Let me see if I can call in. Do you mind? I think so. You know, yeah. Cover charges. All right, I'm going to give it a try here. Now, this is, keep in mind, this is going all over the island of Manhattan live as we, uh, and they're making a lot of friends, aren't they? With, 
No, we've bless been, you. Uh, no good uh, restaurants in New York. Or, or Bergen has. He's a photographer uh, of just general things. Line one. Uh, yes, could I speak to uh, uh, Beecham and Bergen? Hello. One moment. Yeah, yeah. Hello. Hello, you're on the air. Uh, yes, uh, I was, I w was uh, listening to uh, some of the remarks you said about New York City restaurants. Right. And uh, apparently you don't like the way things are run in the city here, huh? Well, the, uh, you know, the service isn't, isn't the best. Uh -huh. And the food isn't quite, you know, what we expect. We, you know, we thought we were going to have, you know, great food, uh, wonderful service, and more of a variety of food. But, uh, now, where, where exactly have you eaten since you've been in town, sir? In uh, about three or four little out-of-the-way places. Uh, we ate at Hurley's on Times Square. Kind of, kind of an out-of-the-way place. Yeah. Uh, we were told that we shouldn't have gone there. Uh, uh, last night, we ate at the restaurant in the St. Moritz. And Rumpelmeyer's. We had breakfast in Rumpelmeyer's, and it was very greasy. <laughs> <laughs> but, but could you be specific? Uh, what, what exactly didn't you like about the place? Well, the, the breads are, uh, you know, we're used to a, a better variety of bread and, and not so hard. And uh, the food just seemed kind of mediocre. It wasn't any We're going to have to get these people all. armed guards. <laughs> yeah, to get them out of here. Well, uh, uh, I'm sorry. We I'm had sorry. reservations at the Saint, at the uh, at the cafe at the Saint Moritz, and they screwed up the reservations. Uh, we and had to the wait. list and goes they, uh, on and on. And, uh, and we're uh, excuse me. About. Excuse me. Could I? Let me recommend a restaurant. I think you'll enjoy it. It's called Tad's. <laughs> Why don't you, Tads, yes. Why don't you give that a try if you have some time? Now, uh, could I speak to your to your wife, please? Oh, uh, uh, you certainly can. Okay. I think this is Dave. Okay. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Hi, uh, Birgit. How are you doing? Great. How, have you had any uh, telephone calls? Yes. And and what do people seem to want to talk about? Restaurant. And uh, uh, do they have any suggestions for you? Uh. Have they given us? No. No, they haven't had any suggestions. No. Yeah, have you gotten any calls on photography? Not one. Uh huh. Have you gotten any calls on the honeymoon? No. Uh huh. Uh, well, you only have uh, about 15 more minutes. Are you enjoying yourself? This is fun, yes. Uh huh. And, and uh, do you think you can make it through the rest of the show okay? I think so. It's oh. real easy, Dave. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Do we, do we have time to listen to them take another call? Yeah. Do, do you, uh, Virga, do you guys have any phone calls waiting now? I don't think so, no. Okay, I'll tell you what, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to hang up and, and maybe clear the line so somebody else will call in and we'd like to hear you take another phone call. Okay. All right, thank you very much. If I don't see you later, have a nice trip back to Tampa. Thank you. Okay, bye-bye. Bye. Okay, so let's see if they get... Of course it's easy, it just shows up and bad mouths everything. <laughs> the hell, I could do that, but I don't. I try to be cheery and pleasant and... She looks great, doesn't she? She looks terrific on camera. And we'll get a get a so, call here just. Uh, we have to stick it out till uh, six thirty. <laughs> <laughs> well, keep those phones uh, ringing. Uh -huh. <laughs> and we'll take them as they come. Okay, here in New York City, it's about uh, seventeen have, minutes we after have six. Some gifts here, don't we? Yeah. Um, what are uh, these little ones? Yeah, wants to be a guest on the show. We have our own uh, sponges. No, those are the guest passes. No, these are sponges. Oh, I see. We have our own uh, inflatable What did she say they were? Or these are great. Yeah, you know those things they give you at the hotel. We hotels. have our, the name of our show is on the cap. This is very nice. We've got thousands of these to give away. We haven't been able to use. And, I'm sure they'll be receiving one of these in the mail. This is this is kind of um, exciting. Do we we, we got to go? We can we win? Okay. Okay. I would like to see him uh, take another call. Of course, nobody's gonna call now. They're scared of this guy. He has one of the worst uh, attitudes of anyone I've ever seen in my life. Give us a pencil. We could uh, write okay. down. Okay. Well, uh, if anything great happens, we can uh, come we can back to these pictures. folks. Okay. There they are. That's uh, Beecham Owen and Bergen Owen live here in Manhattan on their own cable TV show. We'll be back with George Wallace. Folks.